Hey guys, Justin here with americantrucks.com and today we are taking a closer look at and installing the Morimoto X3B third brake light available for all 2015 and newer F-150s without the third brake light camera mounted. Now you should be considering the Morimoto option here for your F-150 if you're looking for an extremely high quality option to deliver more of that blacked out look along with high powered LED lighting to help improve the visibility both with your brake lights and your bed lighting all backed by one of the best warranties in the category. But let's get into some of our features here with the Morimoto X3B. And at first glance, I would say the biggest feature is gonna be the radical departure in appearance from the OE or factory third brake light. Uh, let's face it guys, that factory third brake light, not gonna do too much for the appearance or style on your truck. And on top of that, if you're looking to achieve that all black look or blacked out look with the lighting on your F-150, well, the factory third brake light just isn't gonna do it. So the Morimoto here is going to completely replace your factory brake light with a much more aggressive looking unit loaded with high powered LEDs. Now for the brake lights, you're getting these kind of four three-dimensional blocks or jewels as Morimoto calls them. And those are gonna feature a number of high powered red LEDs providing plenty of visibility for the brake lights both day and night. Now for your bed lighting duties, you have these two horizontal rows here in the middle. Those are gonna be high intensity white LEDs in the middle, also three watts of course. And those again will improve your bed lighting at night thanks to a wider overall pattern with no dead spots. Now construction is going to be extremely solid here at the Morimoto. I would even argue probably one of the best build qualities currently in the category at the time of this video. Now this particular option, it does include the piano black polycarbonate base or housing, which is home to, you know, it's kind of clear, kind of a lightly smoked polycarbonate lens. Now the X3B is DOT legal, has been backed by Morimoto's pretty stout five-year warranty, also one of the best in the category there. A couple quick things to point out here, guys, before we get into pricing, the option that we have on the table, the Morimoto, will only fit the F-150s without the rear-facing camera mounted in the third brake light. Now, if you're watching this video and you have one of those F-150s with the camera right in the middle, well, you are in luck. Morimoto does offer a different option here on the site. It includes the camera and great thing is it's the same exact price as the option that we have here today. Also guys, if you did wanna kick up the safety and style of that third brake light a little bit more, you could always pair up the X3B with Morimoto's F1 style rapid flasher module. Uh, basically that's gonna pulse the brake light, the third brake light that is four times before remaining on. Now that's something you see again in F1 racing, but also in some other options here on the road uh, today as well. And certainly does help uh, grab the attention of maybe any drivers behind you that really aren't paying attention. Price point here for the Morimoto X3B will live in that low to mid $200 range, putting this, I would say, in the middle of the pack when compared to other options on the site. Personally, I think it's a bargain because some of the other more expensive options that we just mentioned aren't really gonna offer the big brand name like Morimoto, the quality, or even the warranty of the X3B here, despite being even more money. So again, for this price point to get these features, uh, along with this solid quality warranty and all that good stuff, certainly is hard to beat. All right, switching gears here, let's get into the install. And a nice thing about the F-150 third brake light design is that it's going to be an extremely simple swap with a couple of screws, plug and play harness, and you're good to go. So because of that, site's gonna call it a pretty soft one out of three wrenches on the difficulty meter, taking you, I would say 30 minutes at most to complete from start to finish. Also wanna throw in guys that uh, Morimoto does include a new gasket to help keep things nice and watertight behind the third brake light after you do your install. So big thumbs up there. Uh, but now to give you a better idea of just how this install will go down on your F-150 at home, let's throw it out to the shop for our detailed walk through and tool breakdown. For this install, you will need a ratchet and a T20 Torx bit. Alrighty, so now we've come up into the bed of our truck here and we're gonna go ahead and get ready to pop off our factory third brake light. And for that, we're gonna grab our T20 Torx bit and our ratchet. We're gonna go ahead and remove the four screws holding it in. Now ours is missing one, but from the factory it should be four.
Now you do want to be very careful with these screws because they can drop down between your bed and your cab and you don't want that. And after we have all of our screws out, we can go ahead and pop our light out. Now you will have to pull a bit of your harness out here to get to the connector. And it may even have its little retainers here clipped into the top of your roof, but you can just go ahead and push those out. It should come out very easily. And then we can go ahead and unplug our factory light here by just pushing down on this tab and pulling out our connector. Now you wanna make sure this end of your connector stays out and accessible to connect your new one. So now that we've got our factory headlight out, we're ready to go in with our new one. And this particular one has a selection of harnesses depending on the functionalities of your specific vehicle. And we found the correct one for ours. So we're gonna start with plugging our adapter harness in to our truck side harness here. We'll go ahead and get our connector in, get that seated. And we can start tucking that back in. We're gonna leave it out for now. We're gonna grab our tail light, and this one in particular has an adhesive backing seal to it. So we'll go ahead, and when you are installing this at home, you wanna go ahead and peel this off. Also, if you wish to clean off this area where your factory tail light was covering, or third brake light was covering, any debris or anything, that would, now would be the time. For demonstration purposes, we're gonna leave our adhesive cover on. So for this tail light, it does change where the harness is gonna come out of the tail light, so you'll have to route your truck side harness and connector back through to your middle opening here, and then go ahead and plug in your connector to your light. And then we'll go ahead and seat it, and the middle dongles here go in place of your mounting screws and then it has the two outer mounting screws. So we'll get those lined up, pop those in, and get that seated. So once you get it in place, this one only uses the two outer mounting screws, so we'll go ahead and get those started. And we can go ahead and grab our T20 Torx bit on our ratchet and run these in. Now again, you are running into a plastic light cover, so you don't need to go crazy with tightening. Just good and snug. And watch it till it seats. And we'll do our other one here. And that should go right into place. You might need to come back. Give a little snug down. There we have it. Alrighty guys, that about wraps up our review and install of our Morimoto X3B LED third brake light for your 15 to current F-150 without camera. Thanks for watching and as always, for everything F-150, keep it right here at AmericanTrucks.com.